There is outrage and anxiety today as hundreds of Art Institute students try to figure out their next steps after the school suddenly shuts down. CBS 2's Tom Wade went to the North Hollywood campus where worried students lined up to get their transcripts. I'm supposed to graduate, supposed to graduate this quarter. Saray Diaz was one of hundreds of students waiting in this line for her transcripts. With the sudden shutdown of the Art Institute of California, her life is now in limbo. I don't know if I'm going to get my diploma. I don't know what's going on if I have to transfer to another school. It's just kind of uh, more like out of the, or not like out of the blue, but I guess it gives us less time to prepare and get everything that we need because they just told us like yesterday basically that it was closed. Students say the abrupt closure followed rumors of financial problems. Terrence Mezadu says he spent around $40,000 on his education here. I'm trying to transfer to another school and it's, it's going to be hard for me to transfer to another school and you know, I just, it's just a whole bunch, it's just a whole bunch of stuff I got to figure out now. State officials say the school was notified last week that the federal government cut off the Art Institute's ability to accept federally backed student loans, usually a fatal blow for for profit colleges. The holding company for the school released a statement that reads in part, we are working with students, accreditors, state regulators, and the U.S. Department of Education to provide as many options as possible for students to include transfer to another higher education institution or student loan discharge. We're all just very upset about this because the way the school's handling it is absolutely unacceptable. The state says they will provide workshops to help students understand how and if they can get reimbursed. In North Hollywood, Tom Waite, CBS 2 News.